Hi, welcome to Lanage Videos, the English channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make this crochet top. You can see here the shape of the top. You will learn in this video how to make this top and how to adapt the size of the top. If you are new in this channel, if you like this video, remember to subscribe and click on the bell. And if you give me a like and if you share this video, it would be great. Remember also that you can find uh, hundreds of knitting and crochet and amigurumi patterns uh, for free. They are free in my website. Uh, you can find the link on the description below. And now let's go with a step by step of this top. The sizes of my top for a medium size are the width is 40 centimeters from the bottom part to the top is 31 centimeters and the sides are 15 centimeters I used the cotton thread the L size of Casa Sol here you can see the specifications of this cotton I used a 3mm crochet hook and scissors. Start this top from the part of the center and we have to make a triangle like this and increasing. Making increases to arrive at the width of the front part of the top. Start with a chain 3 and make 2 double crochet in the chain 1 chain 1 and on the same space 3 double crochet we have now three double crochet chain one and three double crochet this is the first row and then continue with a chain three turn in my case I will count the chain three as the first double crochet so you have to make an increase so you have to make one double crochet on the same space and continue making one double crochet to the chain one space in one double crochet on each stitch to the chain one space in this case only two double crochet and then on the chain one space you have to make two double crochet chain one and two double crochet in the same space And continue repeating what you made at the beginning of the row but on the other side you have to make two double crochet and one increase This is the second row. In my case, I will change the color every three rows. So two rows in my case in white and one row in black. Here I will take the blue color and start again with a chain three. And make one increase at the beginning.
double crochet to the chain one space, in this case five double crochet. And once you are at the chain one space, you have to make two double crochet. Chain one and two double crochet in the same space on the center. and continue making double crochet, the same number of double crochet that you have on the previous part you have to make on this side, you have to make the same number of double crochet on the other side so 5 double crochet and you finish with one increase. Remember you have to make the increase on the chain three. Uh, you don't have to skip this space, remember to make the increase, the last stitch on the chain three. Then I will change the color again chain three again turn and make again one increase at the beginning then double crochet to the chain one space double crochet one double crochet on each double crochet to the chain one space and once you are at the chain one you have to make two double crochet chain one and two double crochet in the same space continue making remember the same number of double crochet that you made on the first side make the same number of double crochet on this side one increase Repeat one more time the part of the increases of the center. Start with a chain three and one increase. And continue making one double crochet to the chain one space, one double crochet on each stitch to the chain one space. Once you are at the chain one space, you have to make two double crochet, chain one, and two double crochet in the same space.
and continue making double crochet to the corner where you have to make one increase. You have to continue repeating the same to have the width of the top that you want. Then, now you want to continue increasing on the top part, but you don't want to increase on the width of the top. So you have to make decreases in one side and on the other and continue making the increases in the center. Start with a decrease. Chain three. And on the following space, you have to make a double crochet. and finish the double crochet with a chain 3 together. This is the first decrease. Then continue making double crochet normally to the center, make the increase at the center and continue with double crochet on the other side. And once you are at the end, you have to finish two stitches before the end and make one decrease at the end. And continue the following row with a chain 3, turn, start with one decrease again, and continue making double crochet to the center. make the increase and double crochet to two stitches before the end and once you're at the end you have to finish with also a decrease You have to continue making decreases at the sides and increases at the center to have this size and once you have this size you have to start making decreases in one side and decreases on the other side. So chain 3 one decrease and continue making double crochet to two stitches before the center of the top. Once you are here you have to make a decrease
then chain three turn And you don't have to continue working to the other side of the top. You have to turn and work on the same side of the top. Start with one decrease. And double crochet to the, to the end of this row. and make a decrease at the end. Chain three. Turn, make one decrease at the beginning. Double crochet in the middle and one decrease at the end. This is what you have to repeat to have the size of the top that you want. Then you have to cut the yarn and place the yarn on the other side of the top and repeat the same that you made on this side. So continue making decreases at the beginning and decreases at the end. Once you have the size of the top that you want, you have to place the yarn on the side. And you have to make an edge of single crochet on the side of the top. Then you have to make a chain two turn and make one half double crochet on each single crochet but taking the back loops. One half double crochet on each on each single crochet but taking the back loops. Once you are at the end of the row, chain two, turn and repeat the same. One half double crochet on each stitch, taking the back loops. This is what you have to repeat to have the complete uh, size of the back part of the top. 
the width of the bottom part of the top and once you have all the stitches and you have to join this part with the with the other side of the top to join it you have to make slip stitches on the side to join the back part with the front part And now I'm going to make a edge on the bottom part of the top. You have to, in my case I will use the same color. I will turn and I will make an edge of double crochet on the bottom part. You can uh, make uh, less stitches on the bottom part to make this part a uh, little bit smaller. And make an edge of double crochet around the bottom part of the top. Once you have all the row with the double crochet, you have to make a slip stitch. In my case, I will make a detail with the black yarn, uh, in this case, the blue yarn. Don't cut the, the previous color, you will need it uh, later. And I will make a detail of one slip stitch on each double crochet, one slip stitch around. And then you have to cut the yarn and continue with another row of double crochet with the uh, white yarn or with the pink yarn in this case. So make one double crochet on each double crochet but taking the back loop, only the back loop of the double crochet of the previous row.
This is what you have to make to finish the edge of the bottom part of the top. And now you have to make the part of the top. You have to start with a chain 50. Chain 50. And once you have the chain 50, we have to make one edge of single crochet on the top part. Uh, make one single crochet, uh, an edge of one single crochet on the top part. And once you have the edge of single crochet, you have to make a chain 50 again. Once you have the chain, you have to chain one, turn, and make one single crochet on each chain. Then one single crochet on each single crochet. And continue on the other side with one single crochet also on each chain. If you want, you can stop here. I will make another row of single crochet. And once you finish this part, you finish your top. Well, that's all. I hope you like it. Remember to give me a like, to share and subscribe. And click on the bell to receive the notifications of my new videos. Thank you for watching and see you on the next video. Bye!